guys, we are right now over in the Mammoth Cave area. And what I wanted to do is basically just to get out, show you guys a few things in this area, including some of the old churches. Now behind me is the Joppa Missionary Baptist Church. This church was established, as you can see from the sign back behind me here. Uh, you can see that it was established back in 1862. And there are a lot of things, a lot of churches in this area that have a huge historical significance. Uh, and of course, this is one of them. Just wanted to show you one of the plaques that is here on the property. And uh, you can see here, uh, of course, this photograph was during a wedding. And uh, it just shows a lot of the people in the community. It tells a little bit about the church itself. On the property, is the cemetery as well as the church itself now the reason that they installed these was to literally support the building to try to help keep the structure where it would be able for future generations to be seen because obviously over time uh, you know these structures are not going to last forever so it's just kind of a way to help ensure that this church is around. So fortunately, the doors are open. So let's go in and see what we can see. It's obvious from the smell that you can tell that there has been some painting done recently. Uh, one thing that I do know was there was some unfortunate vandalism to this church a while back. People coming in here marking up the walls and things like that. But as you can see, there's a pulpit. where the pastor would deliver his sermon. Of course, my wife back there taking some photos herself. You may be able to tell, let's see if I can get up against this wall. I know you probably are not gonna be able to see it on camera, but this wall is actually tilting out and that's one of the reasons why they have the supports on the outside to try to help keep the structure from falling over. There is also a tie right here linking the two sides and you can also see the plate that runs along the top of the wall here. And that is one of the reasons why that I wanted to document this uh, because unfortunately with the ravages of time eventually this structure will probably end up collapsing just due to uh, you know just age so yeah, it's always good to go out to visit places like this to document a little bit about their history and preserve it as much as possible for future generations. There have been a lot of people in the past that have came here that were doing some like these paranormal research, that sort of thing. But uh, I'm basically just wanting to preserve on video a little bit about this church. Now you'll see in the middle of the ceiling here, this is where more than likely the stove set 
And of course, being a building like this, no electricity, the only heat that they had was certainly just an old wood stove. That's set right in here among the congregation. This church is located inside Mammoth Cave National Park and the property is managed by the Park Service. It is one of a few historical churches within the area. We're still very fortunate to be able to have some of these old churches still around. If the walls could talk inside there, just imagine the stories that they could tell. Now the cemetery that's here is still in use. Uh, you can see some of the headstones, some of the dates on these graves. Some of them date back well over a hundred years. And then of course there are some more recent graves in here as well. Unfortunately, there are some markers that the weather has removed your ability to read the names on them. And then there are others that it's still very easy to see. Guys, right now I'm just going to do a quick walk around to show the structure, give you guys a good visual. Guys, this is just a quick video that I wanted to do to kind of help preserve some of the history around this area. Let me know your thoughts down in the comments below. Also check out the rest of the videos on my channel. Thanks for watching. Check out the links down in the description and we'll see you next time.